Hey, welcome to Color Yoga. My name is Kyle and welcome to The Central Flow. Today we're gonna to be taking some time to build up a bit of strength and flexibility in the body just so we can feel energized and ready for the beginning of a new day. Today's practice is a short and sweaty and sensual 15 minute practice. And as in the name of the series, we're gonna be taking some time to feel into our practice. So really embodying our attention in our senses. And before we get going, I'm gonna ask you to let go all expectations of your practice and just have a bit of fun. Just enjoy your flow for where it is and feel into the sensations instead of kind of expecting what you think it should look like. Otherwise, when you're ready, you can grab your mat and let's begin. Welcome back. Bring yourself to a comfy kneeling position. And if you'd like to find a little bit more re relief in your seat, you can always put a towel or a block underneath your bum and your heels. Just gives you a bit of space, a bit more room to breathe. Rest your hands onto your knees, sit up nice and tall. Take a deep breath in. And you exhale, close your eyes. Take a moment to feel into your breath. Allow yourself this moment to let go of anything that you've brought onto your mat. And free yourself from any expectation of your practice. And just enjoy it for what it is. Inhale. Exhale. Nice. One more breath in. One more breath out. Inhale, arms rise up. Exhale, let them through to prayer at your heart center. And if it's in your practice, you can take a moment to just embed an intention or dedication, giving your practice some grounding. When you finish, you can bow your head towards your hands to seal that off. You can blink your eyes open. Inhale, arms reach up to the sky. Exhale, half moon to the left hand side, so lower your left hand down, lighten the fingers and arch over. And keep both sitting bones grounded, wrap the pinky in, open the chest up. Inhale, move through center. Exhale, arch over to the right hand side, left arm reaches up and over. Inhale, arms rise through center. Exhale, bring your hands through to prayer. Shift the weight forward, tuck your back toes, sit back. And if you need to, you can open your knees up just to give yourself a bit of relief. And from here, we're going to shift back onto our heels. So a little bit of balancing. So nice deep breath in. As you exhale, see if you can shift back onto the heels and then forward fold. Well done. Interlace the fingers behind your back. Squeeze your hands together and bow down. Start off with a little bend in the knees so get your belly Pressed onto your thigh, relax the head, and then perhaps pedal the legs out from left to right, just working into the outer hips. Release the hands down. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold and release. Inhale, high mountain. Knees bend, arms rise. Exhale, back bend. Cactus the arms. Squeeze the thighs and arch back. Inhale, arms reach up. Exhale, interlace the fingers behind your back. Inhale, squeeze your elbows together. Roll the shoulders back and down. Inhale, look up. Keeping your hands interlaced. Exhale, bow down with a little bend into your knees. Inhale, chair. Release the arms. Sit back into the heels, arms and fingers reaching alongside the ears. See if you can have a look down. You want to be able to see your toes just at the tops of your knees. Take a deep breath in. Exhale, fold and release. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, plank. Slowly walk your hands to the top of your mat. Engage your core. Lift your head alongside the spine. If you need to, you can always adjust by lowering your knees. Inhale, shift forward. Wrap your elbows in. Exhale, slowly lower down to the belly. Nice and controlled. When you get there, untuck your toes. Hands come underneath your shoulders. Squeeze the feet, press them into the floor. Inhale, cobra, lift the back of the neck up to hold. Now see if you can tease some weight off the fingertips. So use the back and shoulder muscles, draw the shoulders back, take a deep breath in. 
Exhale, release. Well done. Tuck your toes. Take a nice deep breath in. Exhale, tabletop and press into a down dog. Take a moment to arrive into this down dog. Spread the fingers wide. And if you find that your legs are straight, rather, have a little bend to the legs and get the belly down to the toes. Inhale, three-legged dog, raise the right leg. Exhale, right knee to right elbow, shift forward and lightly tap using the core to suspend the leg. Inhale, three-legged dog, right leg returns up and back. Exhale, runner's lunge, lightly step the right foot on the outside of the right hand, lower your back knee to the floor. You can stay here, you've got some options. You can open up the chest, having the hips come forward, otherwise you can work into your quad by sending your right arm back, taking hold of your left foot. Open up the chest, look over the right shoulder. Release the hand, right hand comes back down, raise the back knee. Inhale, look forward. Exhale, Skandasana to the back. Bend into your left foot. Straighten out the right. You can use your hands to support you, dropping down into the heel. Inhale, move through center. Exhale, Skandasana to the front. Same thing, bend into the right. Straighten and flex the left foot. Inhale, move through center. Skandasana to the back. Last time, inhale, center. Exhale, low lunge to the front. Hands frame your right foot. Square yourself off, inhale, rise up onto the feet, high crescent lunge, active through the back foot, square your hips to the front. Inhale to reach up, exhale, airplane lunge, chest forward, arms back. Keep your chest where it is, lengthen out the back of your neck, just your arms move. Inhale, reach forward, exhale, back. Last time, inhale, forward, exhale, bring your hands to prayer. Inhale, lift your chest up. Exhale, launch off onto your right foot. Low flying warrior. Keep your left leg nice and active. Inhale, stand up, draw your left knee into the sky. Reach the arms up. Exhale, figure four. Left foot stacks on top of the right. Bring your hands to prayer. Sit down into the back heel and flex your left foot a lot. Inhale, left leg comes up. Reach the arms up. Exhale, reverse the process. Low flying warrior, hands to prayer, left leg back. Gently touch the foot back down. Inhale, arms reach up. Exhale, plank, hands down, step back. Well done, square yourself off. Now engage your core. Inhale, shift forward. Exhale, chaturanga, lower halfway. Inhale, upward facing dog. Roll over your toes, roll your shoulders back, squeeze your thighs. Exhale, down dog, shift back. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale, three-legged dog, left leg rises. Exhale, left knee to left elbow, use your core, shift forward and tap your elbow. Inhale, three-legged dog, left leg back. Exhale, runner's lunge, left foot comes on the outside of the left hand. Lower your back knee, untuck your back toe. You can stay here if it feels good. Otherwise, the left hand comes back. Take hold of the right foot. Open up the chest and roll the shoulder back. You want to use your breath to lower the hips forward and roll your chest open. Gently release the foot. Raise the back knee. Inhale, gaze forward. Exhale, skandasana to the back. Bend into the right heel. Left leg straightens. Use your hands to support if you need. Skandasana to the front, and Skandasana to the back. Low lunge to the front, bring your hands to frame your left foot, keep your back heel up, inhale, look forward, exhale, rise up, high crescent lunge, hands alongside your ears. Inhale, exhale, rocket ship, chest forward, arms back, now just the arms move. Inhale, reach forward. Exhale, back. Inhale, forward. Exhale, back. Inhale, forward. Exhale, bring them through to prayer. Nice. Inhale, lift your chest up. Exhale, launch off. Low flying warrior. Balance on the left leg. Keep your right leg nice and active. Release. Inhale, stand up. Draw your right knee into the sky. Arms alongside your ear. Exhale, figure four. Right foot stacks on top of the left. Bring the hands to prayer and sit down. Just a few breaths here. Square your hips off. 
Flex your right toes. Keep your chest nice and open. We're going to reverse this. Inhale, Tadasana. Right leg up. Arms reach up. Exhale, low flying warrior. Right leg back. Hands to prayer. Gently touch the foot back down. Inhale, arms reach up. Exhale, plank. Hands down. Left foot back. Last one with control. Inhale, shift forward. Exhale, Chaturanga. Lower halfway. Inhale, upward facing dog. Over the toes, squeeze. Look up. Exhale, downward facing dog. Shift back. Inhale, knees bend. Look forward. Exhale, make your way to a seat at the top of your mat. Well done. Extend your right leg out. Left leg comes in. Fujanrasisasana. Flex your right toes. Raise your arms up. Twist towards the straightened leg. And with your exhale, shift forward and release. Release to roll up, exchange your legs out. Right leg comes in, flex your left toes, get into the front of your sitting bones, arms rise. Exhale, shift forward and release. Release, extend both legs out. Inhale to lift up. Exhale, slowly lower down onto your back. Place your heels down, knees up. Swim your fingers back. You want to be able to touch the back of your heels moving into bridge pose. And your feet are as wide as your hips. Now raise the hips up to the sky. What's important is that you engage your glutes and your core. Press down through the heels. Now imagine there's a block in between your legs. Squeeze that imaginary block. Lift the hips up. If you have the range, you can interlace the fingers behind your back and roll the shoulders as you lift the chest up and backwards. Close the eyes. Take one sensual breath in and one long sensual breath out. And gently lower your spine, upper, middle, lower, and window wiper your knees from left to right. Keep your eyes closed. Releasing the spine and the hips. Draw both knees into your chest. Give yourself a tight squeeze. Inhale, raise the forehead up towards your knees. Take a moment of gratitude for your body and your practice. Exhale, release into Shavasana. Take up some space. When you're ready, arrive into stillness. Allow your body to rest and relax. Inhale. Exhale. Well done. See if you can lay still, feeling into your breath, allowing your exhales just to release and relax yourself further into your shavasana.
You can lay here for as long as you like. When you do decide to get up, see if you can feel into your movements, just holding onto the breath. Thank you once again for putting such amazing effort into your soft practice and all the support into this channel is so greatly appreciated. If you have any comments or questions, I will be in the comments section. Otherwise, I'll see you here next time on your mat. Namaste.